Well, we're gonna mix it up a little bit, a little bit of tennis and a little bit of music. So we have basically on the fly a game that we love to play. We have four men's semifinalists. And if they could walk out to any song game, what song would they walk out to? So I'll kick us off with Dominique Team. What song would he be walking out to in Arthur Ashe? I feel like he's been such a badass throughout this whole tournament and he's really, really coming into his own. You know, I think we're, we're about to see an era where he's, he's emerging as, as one of the top guys. So I just, I feel like confidence, swagger. I feel like he should walk out to like some ACDC or something. From Austria, three-time Grand Slam finalist, Dominic T. I'm, I'm literally picturing it. I'm lost, I'm like, Dominic yeah. T, boom. Like, oh, this is a vibe. <laughs> <Da-na-na>. <laughs> Da-na-na. You know, that, uh, it, that, that just fits to me. Nick, do you have one you want to go? We'll go back and forth. No problem. Pablo Carreño Busta. He's the least known of these four semifinalist yeah. teams, but he's a Spaniard, and he's a guy that plays a pretty a physical brand of tennis. Because he's Spanish, you know, I'm, I'm really feeling some flamenco, you know, maybe some Paco de Lucia, you know, who's who's a great Spanish guitarist that I really dig. You know, that, which is also a very physical type of music to perform. So, you know, I'm feeling some like, some really fast, intense flamenco. From Spain, Pablo Carreño Busta. Nice, I love that. <laughs> That's a physical dance performance too. That's exactly. the first thing that came to mind. Flamenco, like it's intense. Yeah. The yeah. motion is raw. I love it. I love this one. All right, I have one for you. Daniil Medvedev, looking sharp. We talk about being business. He's all business. Looking good this U.S. Open. He's probably my favorite new player. You know, thinking about last year and how he sort of became the villain and sort of embraced that, I'm feeling some like heavy metal for him. You know, something, <laughs> something sort of dark. I don't, you know, we could just go with, with some like Slayer or like Metallica. From Russia, 2019 finalist, Daniel Medvedev. <laughs> I, I'm feeling that one. I, I, you got me at Slayer. I was like, Raining Blood? Like, what are we, oh, like, I were, could okay, see okay, this. Okay, okay, yeah. All right, yeah, Slayer, <laughs> Raining Blood. Great, let's do it. I mean, we could just do a mashup, right? <laughs> Slayer into a Metallica. I love that. Okay, last but not least, James. And by the way, guys, we didn't prep James. He's coming up with these on the fly, which is amazing. Last but not least, he's kind of a complicated character, so I'm intrigued on this one. Alexander Sasha Zverev. He's kind of flashy. You know, he's got his his chain. Um, You know, he loves playing with the crowd. I'm feeling something, like, funky and, like, disco-y and sort of, like, you know, show, maybe like uh, like chic, like Le Freak. He's kind of has that personality. You know, I just picture him, you know, like with his gold chains, like out on a yacht. From Germany, world number seven, Alexander Zverev. Cool, cool, Do you feel me? <laughs> Yes. I totally, I totally feel you. I get him like walking out, and he's like pointing, like yeah. pointing kisses to babies, pointing exactly. at people. Exactly. Tap, 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 or maybe, like, or I'm maybe, totally maybe, it. maybe like Bee Gees, you know? Yes. Uh, oh, there we go. Staying there alive. Yeah. Staying alive. I mean, he's, he's, he's staying alive. alive in this tournament. Deep in the tournament. <laughs> Shockingly, like sometimes I don't realize that I know music, and like having you, I was a bit nervous because I knew you were going to talk music, and I was like, I hope I know the song. And this made me feel so good because you gave me some songs that have lifted my spirits. This, the warm up is all about feeling good and you made us feel good today, James. So thank you so right much. Right on, thank you. All right, y'all, that was thoroughly entertaining. How incredible. Thanks, James, again, incredible.